just absolutely denounce that and say that that is absolutely awful and shouldn't be anywhere in the world, but especially at Clemson. Students at Clemson are speaking out after white nationalist flyers were posted around the campus. They are alt-right recruitment flyers, and they're asking students to join the white nationalist movement. Tonight, the school is speaking out about why they took these flyers down, and it's not because of the message sent to students. 7 News reporter Kirsten Glavin is joining us live right now at 7 on Main here in downtown Greenville to explain. Kirsten. Well, I mean, the alt-right flyers were found yesterday, and it's not the first time the school has dealt with racially charged messages around campus. It was around 5.30 in the morning Monday when an alt-right recruitment flyer was found posted onto a glass door at the Fike Recreation Center. I think it's disgusting. I think that is not, definitely not reflective of the Clemson campus or the Clemson student body as a whole. Many students like Smith say the message isn't welcome on campus. Part of the flyer reads, white people, are you realizing diversity means less white? And tired of political correctness, join the alt-right. University officials say about a dozen of these alt-right recruitment flyers were found scattered all around campus on Monday. Some students want the school to step up and do more to stop flyers like these from popping up. I think that right now it looks like a problem, and I think that if they don't address it, it will be. Philip Sykes is the communication director for student affairs. He says once the flyers were reported, they were taken down immediately, but not for the controversial message. He says it's because they broke school policy by not hanging on billboards and because they weren't approved by the school first. The issue with the flyer that took place Monday was that it did not have an approval stamp um, per our regulations. Sykes also told 7 News this isn't the first time these types of racially charged flyers have made the rounds at the university. Not uncommon to see uh, these types of, um, I guess, conflicting messages posted on campus, um, but uh, it's not the first time this situation has come up. Some Ku Klux Klan recruitment flyers were also found on campus last year. Sherman Jones, a member of the Black Student Union, says he's seen a number of racially charged incidents happen on campus during his three years there. I think that more education and more proactiveness on the side of the school would be nice. And Clemson police are also now looking into this. We, we hear the student talking about more proactive action. They want something more done by the university. What kind, what kind of action are they asking for? Most students said they felt like they were out of the loop uh, in the situation. Many of the people I spoke with today said they actually hadn't heard anything from the school about the flyers and that this was the first time they heard anything at all about them on campus. So most people, I believe, just want to be kept in the loop and know more about what's going on uh, when these issues do arise. All right, Kirsten Glavin, thank you. Did a student at the